Uh, welcome to RGL 3361, two year pristine with logo fracture and five star. We have a 25% filler to run, filling up the remaining four spots in the break. Fillers in this one, we have Jeff S, Robert Kirby, Charles S for three, DCQ for four, ENH, Paul B, Michael R, Eric G, Jason B for two, Gilbert M. That is going to be 16 of you. Top four are going to make it on into the break. Let's go seven times. Top four are in. One, two, three, four, five, six in your top four, making it on into the break. Charles S, Gilbert M, ENH, Jason P. Yeah, there is retail select WNBA coming as well, yes. All right. Uh, top four are in the break. I think I'm going to do a video. I think I'm going to record that on Friday and uh, put it out maybe for Monday, for Monday's video. Uh, everybody who missed, you'll be in our filler giveaway at the end of the night. Uh, but we're going to roll two dice. Tell us how many times to randomize each list. After we randomize in, your teams are assigned... Give you a couple minutes to trade. Your bounties are currently sitting at 100 on the minor. Major bounty at 2450 and your super fractor at 1160. Walter B on top down to Jason P on the bottom. Let's go five times. Five times on your names. Five times on your teams. Let's get after it. So, I mean, as we continue to talk about select WNBA, uh, Brian L on top, Robert Kirby on the bottom. I do think that the first Caitlyn Gold is going to sell for like $5,000 legitimately. Uh, Caitlyn, Angel, and Cam Brink are going to be very, very hot out of the gate as far as singles prices go. Um, but Select Hobby being $750 when Select WNBA or Select NBA is like $550 makes no sense. It simply makes no sense. Diamondbacks on top, Nationals on the bottom. Uh, one, two, three, four, and five. Angels on top. Mariners on bottom. I think that Reese and Caitlin stuff will hold value long term. I really do. Uh, Brian L with the Angels. Walter with the Giants in our gold member spot. Gilbert with the Reds. Ian H with the Royals. Charles S with the Dodgers. We have Walter with the Guardians and the Blue Jays. Sam Lee with the Pirates, JML with the Cardinals, Ryan M with the Yankees, Michael Kim with the Rays, Bobby D with the Tigers, Brandon H with the Twins, Eric G with the Braves, Justin J with the Rockies and A's, DCQ, Astros, Robert Kirby, Marlins, and White Sox. Uh, Brandon A with the Cubs, Gary E with the Rangers, Rasheem with the D-backs, DCQ with the Red Sox, uh, Jason P with the Phillies, Eric M with the Mets, Jason P with the Nationals, Diego with the Brewers, David B with the Orioles, Lenny with the Padres and Robert Kirby with the Mariners. So you do have to remember, though, that this is the first time they've ever done Select WNBA. And some people just really like Select. So first time ever. So I think that even players like uh, Sabrina will do very well. I think that, you know, most of the, the bigger stars in the WNBA, their golds, their autos will do much better than their Prism counterparts, their Optic counterparts from a few years ago. Just because this is the first time we're seeing select. I think like things like courtside golds for a lot of the players that even aren't rookies will do well. Asia is going to do very well. Drew pointed that out. Uh, so you are going to have some players that are going to be very well, good. Without Caitlin, there'd be no WNBA. That's not true. They did WNBA last year and Caitlin wasn't in the league. So where's your thing there? Uh, Prism WNBA has existed since... Ooh, I'm trying to remember first Prism WNBA. 2020. Optic didn't Optic come out in like before that? Optic existed 6 18 19 Optic, yeah. 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 We get about 3 to 4 WNBA sets a year just like with NASCAR we get about 3 to 4 a year is one of the more I guess niche sports in the hobby I guess you would call it. Even though WNBA like blew up in popularity this year, it is one of those sets where, you know, one of those sports where 20 sets probably isn't justified like basketball or baseball or football but it was with Rittenhouse for a while as well yeah before that uh give you all another minute or two to talk trades what world am i in that a caitlin clark will sell for more than a mickey mantle auto i mean that's just the current hype train where 
Mickey Mantle has 10,000 autos out there, even though he passed in the 90s. Has a bunch of autographs out there. Signed for many years after he stopped playing. Decades. And Caitlin doesn't have many cards. Many autos. I don't know. I guess this is good for a video. What do, you, what do we start with? We start with Logo Fractor, I think. So if you ask me what I think Select WNBA Hobby is worth, probably about 250 bucks, 300 bucks, probably be fair. Total, probably like 500 tops. Uh, that would be my personal opinion, based off of the current market where all the where everything is, all the products and where they align up. Fodal will have two guaranteed parallels to three or less. Or a number just a three, excuse me. Alright, let's go ahead and do our base packs first. No chance at parallels, autos. Only base cards out of these, so we're looking for... Ellie and Judge and uh, Shohei. Sold my base Bowman at my shop, yeah, for 30 bucks. Her Sapphires are doing like 40 right now. Andrew Abbott, Seth Lugo. Awesome, I'm glad to hear that arrived, uh, Ian. Uh, Diaz, JP Crawford, Cody Bellinger, Jai Mercandolario, Castellanos, Gray, Sal Frank, Mickey Moniak, Adley Rushman, Royce Lewis. I don't know why I'm saying the names of base. All right. Two Logo Fractor Packs. Purple in here. Spencer Steer. Ryan Noda. Michael Harris. Matt McLean. Purple. Cubby. Shota. 237 of 250. Shota. Imanaga. Uh, going to the Cubs. Going to Brandon A. Shoda. And green in here. Uh, Gorman, Slade Sazoni, Riley Green, Mookie Betts. Green is going to be Aaron Nola, 52 of 99. Sorry, dude. You have a good night, my friend. Aaron Nola for the Phillies going to Jason P. Let's go ahead and do 2023 Logo Fractor now. We are sold out for the night. Thank you guys for selling it, selling us out. Two breaks left after this one, and we're going to get out of here a little earlier than normal. I'm okay with that. We've been pushing late. We, we went till 6 a.m. on Sunday morning. So I'm okay getting out of here a little earlier on a, on a Wednesday than normal. All right. Nothing really too much of value here. Maybe a Corbin Carroll rookie or that's about it. No uh, MVP buybacks because this is last year's. So just base in these. We do care about those logo fracture packs quite a bit. Uh, Diaz, Manoa, Soto, Tyler Freeman, Drew Waters. I talked a little bit earlier about the amount of Wemby's hitting the market right now, and I know it's a lot all at once, but if Wemby had been signing for Panini, there would still be way, way, way more uh, Wemby autos on the market than right now. So I still think there's way less than there there would be had like there's way less Wemby autos on the market right now than there is Paulo Chet from last year, uh, way less than there is of uh, Bilal Kulabali, Amen Thompson, the guys who are signing uh, for uh, Panini this year. 
Tatis. Uh, Corey Seager. Got Max Scherzer. Shea Langoliers. And Terang, 238 of 250 for Milwaukee. And Bryce Terang. I see two color in here. Forgot what pink is number two. Uh, Jeremy Pena. And Anthony Volpe, rookie for the Yankees, going to Ryan. Is that an auto? I don't think that's an auto. Christian Yelich, 76 of 199 on the pink. And we do have an auto. It's actually Max Meyer. Surprise me. Uh, Max Meyer on the green auto for the Marlins. Going to Mr. Robert Kirby. 52 of 99. Did I buy any Wemby Mercury? I have one or two on the way. One or two. I'm not sure. Uh, Yelich 199. So we're only doing a couple of those if we do. I, I know we're going to do at least one. We might do two and that's it. And a Volpe as well. Let's go back to 2024 logo. Autos are rare in 23 logo. Yeah. Do I have a second favorite team behind the Mariners? I have the uh, San Francisco Giants. You can buy a 2006 Porsche Cayenne Turbo for 8000 bucks, says Jake. Well, on that note, you could buy a Porsche Cayenne Turbo, and you are correct. But I worked in a German car repair shop, and I wouldn't ever own, own any Porsche. You can have a Porsche. You can buy a used Porsche and pay 8000 for it, and then sink 27000 into it to fix it. Uh, John K, it's just because my friend hit one and he's not sure if he wants to sell it or not yet. So he, he's not sure if he wants to keep it or let me have it or what the deal is. So I have one coming. Um, but I don't know if I have a second one coming. Uh, Gonzalez. Balzovic. Blake Snow. Jackson Holiday rookie. We work on BMWs. I didn't work on anything. I was a service advisor. I told people. I got to call people and tell them that their Porsche Cayenne Turbos... Needs a $7,000 repair. Yoshida. Soda. Nick Lofton. Justin Seal. Fernando Tatis. And Brian Hayes. You don't recognize me from from an auto repair. I only worked there for six months. You do not recognize me. <laughs> you went to school with me? You did not go to school with me. All right. You got Cub Ryan Hayes, Gericle, Lawrence Butler, uh, Jordan Lawler on your rookie. Uh, Ryan Pepeo, 89 and 150. Where'd you go to school? Oh. One famous person went to school with RGL. We heard that. You guys did hear that story. I went to the school of hard knocks. Jordan Lawler. Listen, just tell me that I look like Ralphie Mae like everybody else. Second pack. Stingy. Uh, Christian Yelich, Brenton Doyle, Keaton Wynn, Christian Encarnacion, and Strand, and Lordy's Guriel, 120 of one, uh, 250. Stingy. I swear I know you from 20 years ago. What's your name? I'll tell you if he... What's your name? I'll tell you if uh, if I know you or not. Do you ever live in Massachusetts or Florida? No, I did not. I went to Scientology camp with you. I don't think you did. This sounds like a cybersecurity. It does. Listen, just give me the last four of your social security and your birthday. We're at the same Bible study. Uh, yeah. Which of these addresses doesn't belong to you? <laughs> did you ever get those and you're like, wait, did I live on that street? I've done that. Uh, Brian Bello, Garcia. Ethan Small. First three are more important than the last four. Alvarez. 
trying to reach you about your car's extended warranty. That was always a fun conversation on service repair. Well, I have warranty. Yeah, but your warranty doesn't cover that. Boscatino. Ozzy Albies. Logan Webb. Herman Marquez. Who's your daddy and what does he do? <laughs> All right, two logo fracture packs. From parts unknown. I'm from parts unknown. Uh, Justin Verlander. O'Neill Cruz. Wander. Carlos Correa. Man, these logo fracture packs have been rough. Miggy. Hats off to Miggy. 61 of 250. Miggy retires and the Tigers make the playoffs. Unreal. Going to Detroit. That's uh, Bobby D. Four logo fracture boxes and we can't get anything good. Come on now. Uh, okay, we, we got a couple color. Uh, Luis Castillo. Miggy got a ring in Florida. He, he did, yes. Uh, Sandy Alcantara, yellow of Tovar, 35 of 75, the Rockies. Yep. And Brett Beatty, 32 of 99 on the future stars green. All right, well, that was a little rough. That was a little rough. Let's do 24 pristine. 24 pristine. Miggy will not get a ring if they win. He might get to throw out the first pitch in a World Series game. They're not giving a, a player who retired last year a ring. Kicking off, we have Quinn Priester for the Pirates on your uh, Pulsar. Pristine. Shane McClanahan. And Adrian Beltre on the Refractor. Yeah, they give him a ton of money. He's, he's plenty happy. Ramirez, uh, Ty Cobb. We will have Cosmic this weekend, yes. Triolo, Stott. Frozen Ropes of Mike Trout. Lias Diaz, Ozzy Smith. Yes, we will absolutely have Cosmic on Saturday. It's already in the house. I already have a few cases here. The rest of them arrive tomorrow. Pete Alonzo, the Polar Bear, 22 of 25 on the Orange Pulsar. Going to the Mets. Going to Eric M. All-Star Game. Jersey right there. I heard next year they're going back to their team jerseys for the All-Star game. Much better decision. Did not like those All-Star jerseys the last couple years. Mason Wynn, Refractor, and Jimmy Rollins, 27 of 150. Pristine is fun. Doug, do you know, Doug, that you just won a gold member spot a couple breaks ago? Lawler. Glaber. Pristine production of Hank Aaron, Mitch uh, Keller, and Fred McGriff. Doug, you just won a gold member spot a couple breaks back. Another one, yes. Yes. It's like your third one in a month. Gunner, 70 of 75. Gunner Henderson Auto. Wow. Going to Baltimore, that's Benson. There you go, Benson. That's some squirrels for you. On card, Gunner Henderson to 75. There we go. Congrats, man. Congratulations, sir. First one touch, first legitimate one touch of the break. Got Matt Olson. If I can open this pack, Matt Olson. And Matt Olson, um, and Matt Olson, twenty-two of seventy-five. Ah, uh, sounds good, Matt. CJ, Justin Verlander, Cabrian Hayes, Real Amuto, Frozen Ropes of Wyatt Langford, Bobachette, and Luis Matos. Frozen ropes of Wyatt Langford for the Rangers going to Gary.
Gunner was nice. Maybe we'll see him again as a rookie in 23 pristine. Last box of 23 pristine that I have on the shelf. Cedric Mullins also for Baltimore, 34 of 75. Wanted Benson. Sounds good, Jose. Stay safe out there, man. Uh, that is going to be Dave Winfield, 37 of 99 for the Twins on the pristine pieces. I've been talking about Wemby Mercury in depth today. Um, some of the cards look goofy, um, but it's an $8,000 box without a, with about a $4,000 floor. And, I mean, there's going to be some huge cards that come out of the product. Does it look great? Is it perfect? No. Is it going to sell very well? Yes. Is there a LeBron and Wemby dual Super Fractor Auto floating around somewhere out there? Yes, that's a monster card. So, I have mixed thoughts. Like, it's good and bad. I just kind of wish that... I kind of wish Tops would have handled the Wemby stuff differently. It's not a cash grab. It's not a cash grab. Uh, Trey Cabbage for the Angels. Because there's a demand for that. There's a demand for his RPAs. I'm just going to have the Rookie of the Year, one of the most generational players ever, just not have... Any RPAs, licensed or unlicensed? Trey Cabbage. The LeBron Victor Superfractor has not been pulled. Uh, Craig Kimbrell and Mookie Betts. There's like 11 of them. I saw on some of your member exclusive videos that you made stocking stuff as well. I make them again this year. That is the plan. We will be doing those at some point this year. Uh, we have an orange in here. Uh, Josh Young, Wade Meckler, Derek Jr., Mauricio, Dawson, oh snap of Jackson, Churio, and a Swings of Summer of Corbin Carroll, not an orange. Going to the Diamondbacks, that is Rasheem. Correct, Doug. If the if the floor is 4000 bucks, that's better than pretty much every high-end product out there. Uh, Corbin Carroll, Swings of Summer. So a cash grab would be something like the, like I'll tell you what I think a tops cash grab is, and I have no problem saying it, are the tops nows with one auto, one 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 auto, and five hundred thousand people buy a paper card that costs eleven cents to print, and there's only one auto out there. That's that's a cash grab. Every box having two Wemby autos, one being an RPA to ninety nine or less, that's not really a cash grab. That's them trying to. Do their best to meet the demand for Victor Wemba and Yama autos. Whether or not we think it's a good product, but I don't think it's a cash grab. It does not meet the qualifications of a cash grab to me. Cole Reagan's 22 of 75. It would be a cash grab if there were no autos or like one auto per every five boxes or something. Cole Reagan's 22 of 75. I'm not defending them. I don't think it's a particularly great product, but I do think that the floor is much higher than the product of most, or floor is much higher than the floor in most high-end sets. Uh, Fred McGriff. And how about a Vladdy to five? Going to Toronto out of nowhere. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. going to Walter. Going to Walter. That's a nice one. I don't know if it's a one-touch or not, but it's nice. It's $8,000 a box. You are correct, but you're not going to find a box that has less than $4,000 worth of value out of it. Whereas we could buy, we could rip a twenty-five hundred dollar box of Impeccable right now, and get less than five hundred back. That's twenty percent. So, uh, Cody Bellinger, oh snap of Evan Carter, Zach Gallen, and Mason Wynn. I'm not defending it. I'm just saying the reality of high-end sports cards right now. You open a three thousand dollar box of National Treasures basketball, which comes out next month. It might be three thousand. It might be four thousand. You might get six hundred bucks back. Yeah, you open flawless for ten k like last year. You might get a thousand bucks back. I don't know. Vladdy five of five on the red. So if you look at it that way, compared to all the other high end, it's fine. If you don't believe in Wemby, that's a whole different story. But. In context of what it is and what it compares to in the hobby, it's fine. How about Decafodal? Let's talk about Decafodal. I'm exhausted. I don't want to talk about Decafodal. 
Tops now has $8,000 Wemby boxes. There is a product called Tops Mercury, if you're not familiar. It's all Wemby. I think it's 10 cards, two autos, and some parallels. Chances at dual autos. That's what we're talking about. All right, 2023. Final box pretty much ever of this product. I don't think we're going to do any more of this. This is the last box I have. Byron Buxton going to kick it off. How about Match Attack? I don't know enough about Match Attack. Byron Buxton. People really like Match Attack, though. That's what I do know. Match Attack is actually really popular over in, like, India, I believe. Uh, Alec Burleson and Chipper Jones on the Refractors. Uh, Soto, Wright, Nolan Gorman, Mark Grace. Uh, Alcantara, Sammy Sosa, and Going Going Gone of Paul Goldschmidt. I have not really seen the singles market on eBay for what the uh, singles are doing out of the product. I have heard that the RPAs are already like $3,000 minimum or more. And there's two Wemby autos per box, per $8,000 box. Uh, Buddy Kennedy is going to be your first team for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Looking for Corbin Carroll. We're not looking for Buddy. So you're guaranteed two autographs of the guy. Uh, Vinny Poscatino and Orange to 25. Tim Salmon to 25. Uh, that is going to be number three of 25. I mean, we have more people coming into the hobby than ever before so say it's dying i i think that it's evolving it's changing is a better word dying it's not diving it's not dying robbie ray mantiply bellow nolan ryan alvarez Baguara, pedro martinez graham ashcroft and uh going going on of mark mcguire it's evolving you might not like the trajectory that it's going but it is definitely changing Uh, your auto is Miguel Vargas. Going to the Dodgers. Going to Charles S. I think your first mistake is calling it an 8K investment. If you hold it, if you keep it sealed, maybe it's an investment. But as soon as you take the wrapper off, it's no longer an investment. You're taking a risk. Taking a gamble. The dirty word. The dirty G word that we don't want to say. Uh, Joe Musgrave. And we have pink to 15 right here. JP Crawford for the Mariners. That is going to be a red, actually. Four or five. Doug with the five gifted. Thank you, Doug. Appreciate that. Uh, JP for my Mariners going to Mr. Robert Kirby. We like JP here in the Pacific Northwest. Wemby will only be average this year. Plenty of centers will hold him down. They didn't last year. What new center is going to come into the league that's going to hold down Wemby? Why didn't they do it last season? Is Zach Eady the is Zach Eady the the Wemby killer? See the Wemby killer? Uh Von Grissom? Uh Buxton, CJ Crone, Bernie Williams, and an O snap of Fernando Tatis. Wemby's got Chris Paul this year. One of the greatest point guards of all time. He's got Chris Paul in one of his final seasons. Chris Paul got nothing to play for. They're not gonna win a championship. He's got no He's got no pressure on him whatsoever. Chris Paul is going to be great this year. Chris Paul has nothing to play for on the on the Spurs. Maybe a play-in game spot. He doesn't have pressure. He's not on a championship contender. Chris Paul is going to be awesome this year. Orange. Clayton Kershaw to 25. Kershaw going to the Dodgers. Charles, 5 of 25. Man, Chad is on fire right now. Chad is on fire. I will say. Wemby also has Stefan Castle. Yep. I mean, we can speculate, but in a few weeks, we'll be seeing in action. Uh, Nolan Ryan and Kerry Carpenter, this guy. Being good for Detroit. It was Klingon. Donovan Klingon, the Wemby killer. 
Donovan Klingon, the Wemby killer. Oh boy. Uh, Beltre, Freeman, Ryu, Encarnacion, Anthony Volpe, rookie. And Kodai Singa is going to be on the fresh faces. Two packs to go, and then we have two years of five star in this break. I just want to take this entire replay video, put it on the main channel, because, man, the, the chat here has been great. Um, To 25 auto. That's pretty decent. How about Juan Soto for the Padres? Wow. Going to Lenny. Nice. Lenny, 5 of 25. That is some squirrels right there. Juan Soto to 25. Second really nice auto. We have this one, and then we also have the Gunner from uh, 2024. Uh, we have a Mem right here. Or an auto around the diamond. Scott Rowland for the Cardinals. Oh Cardinals is God. JML. Oh, I can't stand that That's guy. the best card we could have hit for JML. Oh. Scott Rowland. Such a deserving MVP. Oh, Hall of Fame, he's the worst. What a deserving Hall of Famer. Oh. Scott Rowland. Game used mem. That's a game used bat, JML. Uh, Riley Green, Fernando Tatis, Casas Buster. Uh, going, going, gone of Adrian Beltre. All right, final pack of pristine right here. Enjoy it while it lasts. This is it. Matthew, I think he's this is it. This is our final pack of pristine from 2023 that we'll probably ever rip. Josh Naylor, 14 of 75. Guardians. And here we go. Gibbs NT hit was beautiful. Man, that was a monster. Yeah. Lindor. Yes, Dremski on the purple. 45 of 99. Nailored it. I'm still kind of geeked up over uh, that Gibbs, the three. All right, Max Meyer, Lindor, Pascatino, Vladimir Guerrero, and Brett Beatty on the fresh faces. All right, uh, two boxes to wrap it up. They are both five-star. Let's do 23 five-star first. 2023 five-star, two cards. Everybody knows the rules. I want to see Corbin Carroll for Rasheem right here. Show me a Corbin Carroll auto. Joey Votto. Well, always Joey Votto, isn't it? Joey Votto for the Cincinnati Reds going to Gilbert. And Orlando Cepeda, 7 of 75 for the uh, Boston Red Sox. Pod tickets for things he's going to suck amazing. I know, right? I want to see Wemby when he plays in uh, Portland. Might have to take a day trip down to Portland and catch that game. Blazers, see if the Spurs go play the Blazers in Portland. All right, your final box of the break. Two more cards. I want to see a Skeens auto right here for Sam. Final two cards of this break. How about Adley to 40? 12 of 40, Adley Rushman. It has been a ball to burn kind of night. Going to Benson once again. How long is the drive from Portland to Seattle? About four hours. And we're going to end this break with Jorge Posada. 21 of 50 for the Yankees. Yankees, Ryan M. 
J JML will trade the Scott Rowland for the Jorge Posada if you want to trade Ryan. Please. Adley, I'm going to one-touch up that Adley. That's a nice Adley. Adley's pretty nice. Not our, probably our worst baseball break. I almost just caught myself. Did I catch myself? I think I'm okay. Let's see if we have a bleeder. Let's see. I don't know. Unreal. I think I actually did. I was trying to. Unreal. I can't tell. Definitely caught myself. I'm going to hawk two on this chat and refresh. You get me? So that, go, Amy. It's funny. Let's hit the squirrels for Adley. Got myself. Damn. It's okay. Barely. Talk to a show sucks this Tim. Tim, I need a full recap. T Max says the hobby's dead. Nobody collects. Everybody's playing hot potato selling cards to each other. And Wemby is the French Cody Zeller. Oh my gosh. Let's take a look at the hits. What is going on in this chat? There's no way she's a top five show in the land. Stats don't lie, my friend. Stats don't lie. All right, here's a look at your hits. Posada to 50, Joey Votto, Cepeda, Yaz, uh, Scott Rowland, Kerry Carpenter, Fernando Tatis, JP Crawford to 5, Tim Salmon to 25, Vladdy to 5. I don't remember anything about this break. I was too busy talking the whole time about things other than the break. Dave Winfield to 99, Matt Olson, White Langford, uh, Tovar to 75, Brett Beatty to 99, Guriel to 250, Pepeo, Volpe. Uh, Yelich to 199, Max Meyer to 99, Terang to 250, Aaron Nola and Shoda to 250. And your one touches in that. Uh, let's go look at these. Your uh, non one touch one touches. Josh Naylor, Clayton Kershaw to 25, Miguel Vargas, uh, Buddy Kennedy, Byron Buxton, Cole Riggins to 75, Trey Cabbage, uh, Cedric Mullins to 75, Pete Alonso to 25, Quinn Priester. Why are you watching the channel then, if that's what you think? Just stick to fishing, bro. Adley, 12 of 40, silver signatures. Gunnar Henderson to 75, and Juan Soto to 25. Whole hobby is fishing, that's right. The whole hobby's fishing. That's going to do it for your break.